The VEMD power upgrade is actually a software upgrade that allows the aircraft to take advantage of power that Airbus has known is available uh, in other light single airframes like we've seen in the H-130. Uh, with BLR technology and the fast spin implementation, what we found is that you can get up to 50 additional kilograms of external gross weight, especially when you're flying at above 5,000 feet and in hotter conditions than ISA. Yeah. Essentially, you're taking a wing, turning it up, rotor flow comes down and helps offset the anti-torque and the anti-torque requirements in the back of the aircraft. Keith, can you talk to us a little bit about some of the power upgrades that we'll see at high and hot altitudes that BLR helps assist and improve upon? Well, we were, we were pleasantly surprised with our testing program uh, uh, that we did on top of the VEMD uh, certification in that uh, what we found is uh, with the VEMD power upgrade and the, the BLR FastFin, 8,000 feet at ISA, 485 pound uh, benefit to uh, ex external load operations or, or useful load for the aircraft. Uh, and this, this type of benefit is, is experienced throughout pretty much all of the altitude and temperature ranges that you would normally find on a core service or utility contract. Yeah, I think, I think stability is, is a big piece that we overlook sometimes in the helicopter world. We focus on the power of the helicopter, but we don't necessarily focus on a stable sort of power. And the combination of VEMD power on the H125 with the BLR fast spin enhances that stability. When we initially were looking for a, an operator group, we were looking at the firefighting uh, market segment of aerial work and we found that you know that environment can be pretty unpredictable sometimes yeah. uh, the winds will change on you and sometimes fires will create their own environment so it's not only about just having the power when you're flying at those higher altitudes and those hotter temperatures but it's about having the stability to be precise in doing uh, and meeting your mission requirements one of, the, one of the benefits is centered around wind azimuth tolerances uh, that the, the kit provides. Uh, this particular technology is no exception to that. Uh, I think one of the major benefits of this system is that uh, it virtually eliminates the, any uh, wind restrictions that the aircraft had previously once it's installed. The H125 power with BLR fast then will give you up to 220 additional kilograms, which is roughly 485 pounds of additional external load. And you'll also find that on average, you can gain up to additional 50 kilograms above just VEMD power by integrating the FastFin system. Once the VEMD software was FAA certified, BLR immediately inputted their data to the FAA. And we recently have received that FAA certification so that now if you, you purchase a BLR FastFin kit for your B3E, this VEMD uh, software equipped, at the same time the OSA approval is pending, and we, we expect that uh, here sh rel rel relatively shortly to the uh, how, how things are, are certified in, in Europe. The H125 VEMD power is a little bit of a no-brainer. Most of our operators have known the power has been available for a long time in this aircraft. What Airbus has done now is we've just certified the capability so you can fly it, so that you can go out and do your job every day, um, and so that you can fall inside your regulatory environment, so that you can depend on the performance that is now shown in the flight manual that you already knew was there. It takes a whole lot more than OEMs, their partners, and a couple of good ideas to make this happen. We had some very strong operator partners who helped us champion this, not only in our own organizations, but with our certification authorities. And we're, we're very proud to have worked hand in hand and collaboratively in this nature. The operators have been uh, instrumental with BLR's program and our certification and that their input was very valuable and it kept us focused on uh, the, the performance that, that they wanted versus uh, the performance that we thought we could get. So we, they made us strive a little, little bit harder and reach a little bit higher to get where we're at today.